Welcome to CSET Biology TCP. I am Mr. Wilson from the TCP Academy. You can find us online at CSET Biology TCP, or you may find us at our website at tcp-academy.teachable.com. Today we're looking at the eating and melting curves. Now these refer to curves which are drawn as temperature of matter is pretty much measured at regular intervals as they change state. Now these are plotted against time. In our experiment today, we're going to be showing the melting point, boiling point, freezing point, and that area of condensation. Important to note that the melting point refers to that constant temperature at which a solid will change into liquid. The freezing point is that constant temperature at which a liquid will, of course, change state into a solid. We start out with the ice cube. Applying some flame. Heat energy being applied. Starting to change state. We have both solid and liquid here, reaching the melting point. So it totally changes to liquid. Continue to apply that heat energy. Then we are now having some gas being released in the form of vapor. The water is pretty much evaporating as it boils so at this stage we are having both liquid and gas and this is going to continue until there is total evaporation of the water so there we have the water going down as the gas is pretty much water is converted into gas or pretty much change state changing state from liquid to gas. That demonstrates the heating curve. Last year, many students differed on their CXE exams as they were afraid of failure due to their level of readiness. This year, Mr. Wilson and his experienced team from tcpacademy.teachable.com is here to help you get exam ready. Subscribe for free to tcp-academy.teachable.com we offer courses in CXC Biology, HSB, English Language, and many others. There are several offerings to each course. Enroll in one today. So we're applying heat energy here to the setup. There we have the water. We have a condenser that is cooling that gas, thus condensation taking place there. And the gas is being converted here into liquid, pretty much that condensation point. And you're seeing now the liquid being collected in a beaker. The beaker is uh, pretty much set up in a modified refrigerator and pretty much this again is cooling uh, water that is being collected in the beaker. There you would have realized that all the water would have evaporated, cooled and collected in the beaker. It's important to note here that as the water cools and the temperature of the water lowers, then we are reaching that area we refer to as the freezing point. Now you're realizing that it is both solid and liquid as the liquid changes state into a solid mass of ice. So here we have a total solid ice as the water change state. It went through liquid, gas, and solid. This takes us to the end of the demonstration. Please be reminded to like, share, 
and subscribe. And if you have not yet enrolled to a class, be reminded you can join us online for CSEP Biology and Human and Social Biology classes. That's with Mr. Wilson. We are having flexible class time and, of course, payment. Classes are perfect for students who are seeking individual tutor or they are looking for to be a part of a class. Also, it will be ideal for adult learners and other private candidates. To reach me, please WhatsApp number 1-876-219-5191. You can pay via PayPal, Western Union, or bank transfer. And this should only be done after we would have had a conversation and we can agree on a class time. Interesting. Chemistry is coming soon. Thanks much. Please be reminded to like, share, and subscribe. Get help with CSET Biology SBA Labs and Human and Social Biology SBA Labs at tcp-academy.com. Tim had questions. He wanted to know where he could get help with his SBA Labs. His parents searched but could not find that experience. Tim also made some calls, however, could not find the help he needed. Tim needed an experience he could trust to help him get over the hurdle of SBAs as success was in sight. He met the guides from tcp-academy.teachable.com and they designed a program to help him. tcp-academy.teachable.com was able to help him. So too, they can help you. Sign up tcp-academy.teachable.com for help with your SBAs in biology and human and social biology.